OVO sweatshop. <laughs> oh, Jesus. Why are you doing uh, this? <laughs> oh, my God. It's, it's, it's going to be okay, Drake. <laughs> no, it's not. Mm. Drake 00347. Mm. <laughs> the best rapper alive don't like the way I talk. Uh, come on. He's not the best rapper alive. Lupe Fiasco is the best rapper alive. The way I walk, how mm. I dress, the women. <laughs> I thought we were joking. Bro, don't worry about him, Drake. <laughs> Kendrick wishes he was Drake. <laughs> Hell. We all wish that we was Drake. Drake. I named my son oh. Drake. Okay, the world wishes it was Drake, baby. Don't worry about none of that, man. Am I right, guys? Yeah, yeah. One thousand yeah, hell, yeah. hell yeah. It's gonna be all right. He has too many yes men around. That is the problem with Drake. Drake, right now you have to cook. F the club, sexy red, all of that, like, Right now, Drake, you have to cook because that one is a problem. Euphoria is a big problem. No, it's not, Drake 000221. Because how he know I was popping ass with sexy mm. red? I mean, who don't be shaking ass to sexy red? <laughs> bow, bow, bow. I feel like at this point... It's a universal requirement to shake ass to Sexy Red. And the way that you be moving that juicy Drake BBL. Oh, my God. It sticks. I said that as well. Rick Ross came out with that BBL. That one sticks. BBL Drizzy. Oh, my God. And it doesn't help that BBLs stink as well. Oh, booty be crazy, bro. Like, like. You move that thing better than any man with a BBL I've ever seen. Drake. Oh, Jesus. Like, you really be throwing that ass. You be throwing that ass, bro. <laughs> Talk about some, I'll be raising my son. Who don't be raising their son? Oh, my God. I'll <laughs> be raising my son, I think. Drake, you're an amazing mother. <laughs> Thank you, Drake. Zero, zero, zero. Oh, oh my, my God. God. Drake is the mother of hip hop now that I think of it very sensitive he's always there for you very consistent he gives he's giving off mother vibes he is what's wrong with the way i say nigga do i say nigga bad y'all you say nigga better than anybody that I ever heard say oh nigga my ever God, in the bro. world. Bro. Exactly. Like, like it, it, exactly. you sound so superb when you say nigga. Like, the word just rolls off of your tongue so fucking amazing, bro. Like, like the word was made for you. Like, the it's your word. You should buy the word because you got so much money in the world because you so rich. Please don't fire me. <laughs> Thank you. Party next door. Ooh. I really wasn't expecting him to diss me again. Drake, if you really think about it, <laughs> he really dissed all of us, right? That 1v20 bar was mm. accurate, right? He might have mentioned you, but he really talking. He's talking about the Ghost Riders and the fact that Drake is using and that's the corny part about drake he's using so many gimmicks so many he's he's the guy which brings his crew which doesn't want to fight to the yard and he's like oh come on yo, we, we, we're gonna mess you up bro. to stop with that corny shit about all of us because we the ones that write your stuff <laughs> don't fire me you're right uh, Drake zero 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 seven forty four. Whatever it takes, I know I can make it through. If I hold out, I know I can make it through. Be the best, the best that I can be. Okay, 
I need y'all to work me up at this. Mm. I need everybody in here working around the clock, 24-7. <laughs> we already do. And whoever cooked me up the best verse can go home to their family this Christmas. Damn. No way. For two hours. Oh, that's a long time. Let's get it. What is up, guys? Welcome to another video. I hope you guys are all doing good. In this video, we're going to break down Drake versus Kendrick Lamar. Now, uh, Kendrick just released his diss track, and um, we need to talk about Kendrick Lamar. I've always been a Kendrick hater. That's uh, because I'm a big fan of Lupe Fiasco, and I've heard some of Kendrick's songs, and I've always thought that he's been just like a, a stupider version of Lupe Fiasco for some reason. But I listened to the diss track in its entirety, and you guys, if we're comparing the two, I think Kendrick is up right now. The only way that I can describe these two giants, uh, Drake versus Kendrick Lamar, is Kendrick is Lionel Messi. He just got talent. When it comes to rap, he's just very, very talented in rapping, and there's no way of describing how much of a talent Kendrick is. But Drake, he is the guy that does all the gimmicks. He uses the AI, which I thought was very corny, by the way. But he is, he's a great goal scorer. He puts up the numbers and you're just like, wow, shit, that guy is consistent. But Kendrick is just the better rapper. Okay, I don't even know what to say. If I'm looking at the beef as it stands right now, I think that Drake is losing. Kendrick gets an eight from me. Uh, Euphoria is it's almost there. All you need is a little bit T. If Kendrick can come with something about Drake, I don't know, something nasty about Drake. Uh, he's alluding to that Drake is a P word. If he can prove that that would be crazy i think that is enough to take down drake i'm just mesmerized because honestly i i don't like kendrick but this even i have to say like i know that i'm a hater but i had to just admit like that kid is miles miles ahead and i would like to see Kendrick versus Lupe Fiasco because I think that that would be literally the battle of all battles. I think Lupe is one of the nastiest rappers of all time. I think he is in my in my top ten. He is number one. Yeah, fuck on that push it, pee. Let me see you push a T. What? Push a T? That you shit lame as fuck. He's terrible. Too rare. How many you see? Two bad bitches. Two bad bitches? Like women. It's real competition. You might pop ass with them. Let's see. Still pop ass with them. I'll make sure I double back with you. <laughs> Come on. Stupid. Nigga that says he was signed to a bat nigga. Try to see some assist on the light that wreck. There's some bars which just fly over your head. Like, I heard it damn near 20 times now and i'm just like Whoo. dude i'm black <laughs> i'm black dude that shit was lame as fuck hey we all gone we all gone oh y'all scared yeah oh fuck it man we don't need them man <laughs> lame ass this man how are people listening to this oh, this don't deserve a response right you know what? Take a picture of me. I'm about to respond with an Instagram caption. <laughs> you can't take that. Oh, man, what should I say? There's so many out oh there. Oh my god, that's oh, funny. Oh, oh, what you what you thinking? What should I say? Uh, uh, Instagram story or a photo dump? A photo dump? That would get him going for real. What? <laughs> What's that? Oh my God, Loki! You gotta, you just gotta, you just gotta shoot somebody. What is that? Bro, that's, bro, 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 that, that's the only way. Bro. <laughs> Come on, put that away, Brody. We don't need that. Nigga, that nigga, that nigga, that nigga, that nigga, that nigga, rapping. Come on, you don't believe in me? Rapping, bro. What's no, going on bro, with I, you? I, I didn't heard you my whole life, nigga. I know, mm. I know, I know, I know. Yes, I've been in the game for a long. Oh, that nigga, that nigga, man. 
Mac, don't tell me you're scared too. Come on, man. He's, it's nothing. It's listen, listen, 2 a.m. in Compton, bro. Drop that. Come on. Dude, I'm not Drop using this, that, man. bro. You know what? It don't matter that you don't believe in me, man. Let me get in the booth. That's what everybody want, huh? That's what everybody wants. That's what I'm gonna do. Watch out, man. This is right. crazy. Man. Right. This is crazy. I, I could talk that easy. Easy, that short ass nigga, man. That's crazy. <laughs> I was really, really trying to keep this PG. <laughs> Here we go, come on, hey, hey, Houston, Atlanta, Vegas, Houston, Atlanta, Vegas, okay, come on, there, guys. That is funny, uh, but seriously, guys, I don't know how Drake is going to respond because he has to out rap Kendrick. That is the thing; he has to out rap him. This is my advice to Drake, Drake. I know this is going to be very controversial, but don't do it. If I'm being honest, don't do it. Don't apologize. Just don't respond. Just let it be. Yes, you might take the L and people might look at you funny and... But don't do it. Kenrick is baiting you right now and he wants you to engage. And you can't win this. You can't, like Drake, you can't. It's impossible. So my advice to you, Drake, is like take the L. Just take it. Take it now. Yes, you took two L's, but come out with a new album. Focus on the future. Focus on all of the things that you'll be doing. Like you, you got a crazy new deal with Sony. I don't know if it was for 500 million or 400 million. Just focus on that. Focus on legacy. Focus on that. Like, get out of this space. Don't be doing all these like diss tracks and all of that. Just go the J. Cole route. Do that instead. Because if you engage and you lose twice, that is a stain on your legacy. And all of this, the shit about the ghost riders and all of that, it's like, this is, the, this is the crazy part, that Drake is such a phenomenal rapper and has had such a pulse on hip-hop that it took literally maybe, what, seven, eight people to take him down. I think that Drake should just leave it alone. Both of them showed that they could rap if Drake stops now, he will take an L, but the L is going to be greater if he engages and he continues, goes into round two. Because you do not know what Kendrick has on you. And you try doing the exact same tactic as you did to Pusha T. And Pusha T did that to you. And that's the crazy thing about Pusha T. Pusha T didn't warn you, he just went straight for your neck. I mean, he baited you out, you came, you responded, and then he just went for your throat. If I'm, if I'm Drake, you can't, you, don't engage. Don't. Take the L, it's fine. People will forget about it. But then again, I think Drake is super petty, and I don't really think that Drake understands or knows when to stop. I think... I think he's going to push this one. And I, I think academics and all of these influencers, they're going to gas him up. And he's going to think like, whoa, like I can actually take down Kendrick. But you have to know your limits. You have to know your limits. And Kendrick is, when it comes to this rap, he's not even trying. You can hear it like this probably took him a day to do. Imagine what he could do in a week. The reason why I think Kenrick is so dangerous is the fact that he, he takes so much time. Usually people like that, they're very like super talented, so they don't have to engage. A rapper which isn't talented, if you look at like, Drake is talented, but if you look at Drake, right? He has to constantly come out with song after song after song after song, because if he stops, people might forget about him. But Kendrick, you, you do not forget because his, he's so unique and his rap style, like there's not a lot of rappers which can copy that. So I'm, 
I'm very, very intrigued. I think that this is maybe one of the best times to be a hip hop fan. But then again, guys, leave it in the comment section what you guys think. Do you think Drake will win this? Do you think Kendrick will win this? And I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.